traders welcome back to another entry in this diary today we will be talking about the macd indicator some of you may have seen this before uh, maybe not and we will just go over the introduction and i'll talk a bit about how macd is used as a tool for turning points so let's get started right away so what is macd MACD stands for Moving Average Convergence Divergence. It indicates the market momentum and direction. It has two indicators you can see here. We have the moving averages, which take an average of price action. One is fast, one is slow. And we have this histogram. And what the MACD is used for is to add the confirmation to increase the probability of a bio cell setup and will increase the likelihood of a trade some traders use it some don't um, it depends on your preference so as i was saying we have the histogram bars here and these bars are a snapshot of how fast the market is trending which we can also call it momentum gathering momentum so the bigger the bars the darker the bars we have higher trend higher speed of trend and then we have the averages here they cross over to indicate where price could be turning and we have a fast one which is based on fewer bars fewer candles and then we have a slow one which is the red one here and when they cross over that is combined with the setup so let's just look at the chart briefly how it works in practice here we have an example we have our macd indicator here let's just look at it in a little bit bigger so we can see what that looks like so let's say for example you had a trade setup that told you that in this area here we would have a reversal whatever the confirmations you have whatever your rules say and then you would refer to the macd as a confirmation as an indicator of what's happening in the price so what we what macd trading looks like is when the blue line which is the fast crosses over the red which is the slow we have an indication that a turning point has happened and then we will have histogram bars indicating the momentum so if we place a line when that's happening and we see the two factors coming together many traders use that as a confirmation to buy at this point and then of course the opposite is true so we have the same thing uh, in this case here the market again crossed back over into the cell and we have we can see that the green turned into red the histogram indicated momentum to the downside and the crossover indicated a change in direction and that would be used together with the price with the analysis however we would analyze it identify a turning point and perhaps you would see that when you mark it up the point at which all these factors converge you can you can add the macd over the top and use that as your confirmation so that's what the macd helps with and it's used as an indicator and again just as a reminder an indicator does just that it does not tell you the future it indicates what may be happening to the price and the direction that it's going to go in and that's the summary of the MACD.
So thank you very much for watching. And just as a final tip, use the MACD indicator as your last confirmation in your setup checklist, your checklist of rules for every setup you take to boost the probability of your trades. And trade carefully, trade safe, and good luck. Thank you very much for watching and see you on the next video.